Nephew is a new Linux foundation open source project. Its goal is to simplify the deployment and management of multi-vendor cloud infrastructure and network functions across large-scale deployments. It has been seeded by Google and has a lot of buzz around it. There are two notable things about the objective. First, it focuses on both cloud infrastructure and network functions, and two, it emphasizes large-scale deployments. In our customer interactions, we are finding both to be true. ORAN requires a very tight coupling between the infrastructure and the network functions, so you have to manage them as a set. And Edge requires a very large scale in the tune of tens of thousands of sites today, probably growing to hundreds of thousands in the near future. Despite these innovations, you are probably wondering, why do we need yet another network automation project? Well, one unique and powerful thing about Nephew is its use of Kubernetes as the control plane for this automation. If you're like me, you're probably scratching your head and wondering how this relates to container orchestration. Well, the answer is that Kubernetes is a general purpose control plane that can be used for many use cases and container orchestration just happens to be the first one. The way Kubernetes works is that it has a mechanism to expand its API to declaratively state user intent through something called custom resources. Declarative is an important point here, and it is similar to ordering food at a restaurant. You just state your intent without worrying about the ingredient list, the procurement of those ingredients, the cooking procedure, and the plating. Next, Kubernetes has a concept of custom controllers that convert that declarative intent into a step of actions for a particular domain. Finally, there are mechanisms to monitor the end configuration state and continuously reconcile it with the stated intent, which can actually change over time. Pretty cool, huh? But is that it? Is Nephew just about defining a bunch of custom resources and writing custom controllers? No, that's not it. Nephew adds two other big ticket items. First is the concept of large scale distributed state. There is the concept of a Nephew cluster and edge clusters. Nephew cluster takes the intent and refines it by running it through a set of custom controllers and the edge sites pull that state. The architecture is meant to scale. Second, Nephew bakes in GitOps. If you take a project and fit it into GitOps or DevOps framework, there's a lot of work. That's all eliminated here. You take the intent, push it into Git. The GitOps flow causes the custom controllers to do their job and the edge sites to pull the state. All in all, a very nice project that has the elegance and simplicity of Kubernetes. This alone differentiates Nephew from the plethora of other network automation open source projects. I'd love to hear your comments and thoughts on this topic. Thank you.